Welcome to WebHavi Web Scraping Workshop. So WebHavi is a very generic web scraper which you can configure to extract data from any website. So WebHavi also supports extracting data from e-commerce websites like Amazon, eBay, AliExpress, etc. So in this video, we will see how WebHavi can be configured to extract data from AliExpress. So the first step as always would be to go to the page from which we need to extract data. So let's load up AliExpress website and let's search for LED lights. And once we have reached the page which displays the data, the product listings whose data we need to extract, we can start the configuration. But before starting the configuration, we need to adjust a few settings which are specific for this AliExpress website. For that, open WebHavi settings and go to advanced minor settings and the data selection accuracy, change it to medium and change the minimum number of items required in a list to three. Okay, apply. And then start configuration. Click anywhere on the page click on more options page scroll down because this specific page loads product contents as you scroll down as you can see these are not completely loaded because the user has not scrolled down this page but it does automatically for us when it's mining so right now we can straight away configure the next page so that WebHavi knows how to scrape data automatically from multiple pages Click on the next page link and set it as the next page link. Now we can go back up to the first product and start selecting the data. So let's start by selecting the product name. Let's call it item. No. We can continue with selecting the price. We can also scrape the thumbnail image. can also get the product URL. Now let's open each of these product links and get some additional data. So during configuration, you need to do this only for the first product. But during mining, WebHavi will do these steps for all the products. So click on the link and select follow this link option. And WebHavi will load the details page of that product. And if you scroll down, you can see that the overview section has not been completely loaded. For this reason, you can click anywhere on the page, go to more options page and select a reload page so that everything is loaded. Great. Now, now we can start uh, selecting data. So let's start by, you know, the minimum orders. And the seller name. We can also select this entire description. And now let's see how we can automatically scrape multiple product images. So for this, click on the first small thumbnail image displayed below the main image. Click on the capture HTML option. And you can see that this portion is the high resolution image. So we need to apply a regular expression which selects just this portion. So click on the apply regex button and paste this regex. You can find this regex in the video description below. Apply, you have selected just the high res image URL and click on the capture image button. Now Pavi will ask whether to scrape multiple images because it has automatically detected that there are multiple product images. Click yes and let's name this images. So now let's stop configuration and start mining. If you hit cancel, image URLs will be scraped instead of uh, saving images. And WebHavi will now load the exact same page and select and scrape the data which we selected. It will also follow each product link to get additional data. So 
So as we can see, the product details have started to come up in the minor window data table. So we hope you find this video useful. In case you have any questions, please feel free to ask in the comment section below or you can contact our technical support. Thank you.